My name is Gardathor Cortez and I play the Phantom in Love Never Dies. Well, the Phantom is a very complex character. He's a genius and a musician and a composer and, you know, all, all these things that we know from Phantom of the Opera. There are many layers to him. He's, he's, he's sensitive, but obsessive. He's, he's caring, but dangerous. He's strong, but, uh, but in, in many ways he's weak and therefore such a joy to get a chance to portray. Ten years have, have, have passed since the end of Phantom of the Opera. He has moved to Coney Island, New York, and made himself an empire there among the freaks and the strange people and the roller coasters. And he feels more at home, I think, than he ever did in the Paris Opera, you know, always in the shadows. And he has made a name for himself, but still yearns for Christine, and, and I think um, more than ever. So that's where it, we, we pick up from. His opening line of Love Never Dies is 10 long years. He's trying to make music like he used to do, but he can't because he needs his angel, his muse, his, his uh, you know, the person he, he loves and adores. My favorite thing about the Phantom is uh, that uh, he's so diverse, he's so, He's so difficult, he's so, he's so troubled. You know, he's, he's a genius, but still crazy. I, I can't say that I'm exactly like the Phantom, and I think I'm quite pleased that I'm not. But his, his feelings that he does have, and that's what I like about this character. He's, he's so, you know, there, there's so many colours to him. He's musical, and I'd like to think that I have some kind of musicality. Um, and uh, his outbursts and his, his sensitivity uh, and part of his madness, I think we all have that, or at least I can, I can see it in myself. But you, you learn to control it, and you, and, and you never go as far as, as a person like the Phantom does and always has done. I like um, to relax in my dressing room and you put the makeup on and you put your clothes on and you, you sort of think of the, of the, of the night ahead and, that, and uh, you know, I'm always looking forward to it every night because it's so enjoyable to, to give all you have. You arrive at the theatre and, and suddenly you're on stage, it's very quick, but um, I think the key is to, to have a relaxing atmosphere. The most surprising thing about... Um, playing the Phantom is, is uh, I'm in love with the character, really. It is really one of the best characters I've, I've had the opportunity to, to play and perform. You know, I, I've grown as an artist. Each performance, literally, um, you, you learn something new about yourself and you, you, you become better. And so I think, and I hope, that's the case. I see the phantom in the, in the mirror and, and it always helps. I mean, that's why we put on a costume and put on makeup. I always look forward to giving a part of myself to the audience because I'm doing what I love to do. It's, this is my job, it's, it's my hobby, it's my passion, and it's something that I've wanted to do f from, you know, from, from the beginning. So th that's the best thing about my job. It, it's, it's, I feel very blessed to be doing what I do.